Hey guys, Eddie of Fliptronics, and I'm gonna be going over if you should get the Galaxy S21 or just wait for the S22. Now I've owned every single Galaxy phone since the beginning, and the one thing the S22 is gonna have going for it that no other phone out there will is a 200 megapixel back camera, which is honestly insane. Now, other than that, the phone is going to release sometime in January of 2022. So there's another six months or so before this phone releases. Price point on it, you know, we're probably looking at around the same $799 for the base model, and then it'll go up from there. Other than that, a lot of the same too. I mean, display-wise, going to be very comparable to the S21. Um, there could be an S Pen feature on the S22 models. That would be pretty sick. Uh, you know, I've kind of been reading about that a little bit, which would, you know, kind of make it pointless to get a Galaxy Note series phone. I've also heard they might stop making those, which would be interesting because I've always loved the Note series phones as well. Okay, anyways, as I'm getting more into this topic, if you guys could smash a like button on this video, I would greatly appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed, please do that as well. Now, um, I wanna pull up a quick article here on Tom's Guide. They're a pretty good resource for, you know, trending, you know, new tech news. And they had something, you know, really just about the uh, S22. Now, the release time, like I said, it's gonna be in uh, uh, January of 2022. So that's still around another six months. If you're thinking about getting a new phone, you know, specifically, you know, the S21, I mean, you could always do that, right? Uh, if you could kind of hold off and maybe you want to get the newest phone, which will be the S22, you could, you know, put it off if, you know, you can uh, afford to do that. And if you don't really need a new phone right now. But yeah, some of the things we're going to really be expecting, the camera is going to be one of the main things. You could also expect a, a better battery life on the S22. You've got S Pen and then uh, obviously the processor is going to be a little bit better, a little bit faster. Now, those are just small things to me. I would say if you were going to wait for the S22, it would probably be because you want to get like the best camera phone out there because that's really what it's going to offer. Now that we've kind of talked about the S22 a little bit, I wanted to show you our unboxing of the Galaxy S21 because it's honestly an awesome phone. It also comes in a pretty slick box if I do say so myself and as far as some of the specs on this phone, you've got a 64 megapixel back camera so it's not going to be as good as the S22 on that 200 megapixel but still really good camera, one of the best out there currently. You've got a 6.2 inch dynamic AMOLED display, you got the built-in front facing camera on this phone. Uh, it's got the plastic backing Gorilla Glass front to it. And this is the 5G model, so it's the more affordable one. Um, anyways, we're gonna take it out of the box here so we can just take a look at it. And uh, yeah, I mean, other than the S21, some other good Samsung phones out there right now, I really love the Galaxy A52. I've done some videos um, on that one on the channel. It's a really good phone for the price point. Not gonna be as good as the S21 as far as like performance and everything, but still a really good phone. Uh, the Galaxy um, S20 is still really good as well. But honestly, I feel like the S21 is definitely more of an upgrade uh, to that. Okay, anyways, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna get the wrapping off of this so we can uh, you know take a look at it obviously here seeing what's in the package and you know right now 799 for this phone even when the s22 comes out i feel like they'll probably drop the price point what a couple hundred bucks so you'd be saving yourself a couple hundred dollars waiting another six months i guess but still you know if you really needed a new phone i still think the s21 is uh you know a really solid phone and i mean it looks really nice right now, the plastic backing on this phone, you might think it's cheap, but it's really not. I mean, it, it looks good, as you can see. Feels really good to hold in your hand. Um, it's not like slippery or anything like that. It just feels nice quality. You know, you got the camera on it, too, that looks really good. It's just a fresh looking phone. All right, so we're going to power this baby up.
Okay, and then some of the stock wallpapers on this phone are really nice. I always like this blue one. I think there's a red option too that looks pretty cool. But yeah, I mean, I, I definitely am a fan of the stock wallpapers on the S21. That's always one of the first things I look at on these Samsung phones to see what's new, what's fresh. And yeah, they've got like a red one that looks really cool. The blue, however, you know, I just like the blue. But yeah, definitely a bunch of different options on here for sure. I guess we'll switch over to that one for a second here. Okay, and then I uh, want to get into some of the performance. So I love this game, F1 Mobile. I play it all the time, and I feel like it's one of the best racing games you could play on any phone. It's high graphic, just so you guys can see some of their performance. So let's check this game out. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, the sound quality on this phone is amazing. Super loud. Uh, we are cruising right now. I got to tell you what, man, this, uh, the sound on this phone is really good. Uh, I just kind of noticed it right away. That was like, you know, the first thing. Obviously, it looks great, too, for gaming purposes. The phone is uh, supposed to be really fast as well, so I'm going to compare it to some other phones in um, upcoming videos. <laughs> I'll pass that guy. Trying to get across this uh, this dude up here. Oh yeah, we got him. Man, I'll tell you what, this is just smooth right now. So smooth. All right, so should you wait for the Galaxy S21 or just get the S22? I mean, honestly, you've got another six months if you wanted to do that. The S21 is still an awesome phone in its own right. Okay, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.